Hello. Uh, some time ago I was experimenting with all effect uh, sensors. Uh, this sensor they actually detect uh, the presence of uh, a magnetic uh, field. The reason why I was uh, playing with them is that here I have a, a stepper motor. Actually it's behind this uh, prototype uh, rover that I'm, I'm doing. And uh, here uh, this will, will be used to, to scan the area using uh, ultrasounds. Okay, so there will be an ultrasound sensor mounted on top of here. And the problem that I have is that uh, stepper motors that do not remember the position where they are, basically. So you tell them move uh, 50 step, uh, 100 step, clockwise, counterclockwise, whatever. But then if you reset, for instance, the ADMCU, then you're lost. You don't know exactly where your sonar was pointing at when, uh, uh, the, when you lost uh, the power, for instance. So <clears throat> the idea is, you see here, there's a tiny round thing here. This is a neonium uh, magnet, actually two of them. They are uh, three millimeter uh, diameter and one millimeter thick. So this uh, plastic thing is two millimeter thick. So I was able uh, practicing a hole with a Dremel, 2.8 millimeters to force the inside to a uh, neodymium magnet that just stay there. So the all effect sensor is this black thing uh, here. Uh, it's uh, very thin, so it's easy to put it under the, uh, the plastic here. So the idea is, since I have a magnet and uh, a sensor that is able to detect the position of the magnet, to detect if the magnet is close to the sensor, basically, what happens is that even if uh, I'm not sure where the sonar is when I'm booting up the system, for instance, I can start a scan and uh, uh, find the zero position, basically. So now the test, uh, <coughs> it's using an Arduino Mega. You could use any Arduino. It just happened to have all my other Arduinos hooked to something else. So, and you probably can see, I'm not sure, but the lamp, the LED from time to time it turns on there, okay? And that happens when uh, the magnet is uh, over the uh, all effect sensor. So <clears throat> the idea here is that I'm moving the motor one step at a time and at each step I'm checking if the all effect sensor is high or low. So uh, obviously I will need to check how many steps does it take for the magnet to clear the uh, the sensor because obviously the the real zero will be the middle point but I think you got the concept so this is part of my um, let's say ongoing project for uh, a rover and uh, nothing else is connected at the moment it's just uh, a test for this uh, all effect sensor okay thank you bye bye